Hello, I've got some clothes to show you today. These are things that I've bought for my summer wardrobe. If you have watched my channel before, you may know that I have been on a big clothes buying mission recently after years of not really buying any clothes at all. So I desperately needed some updates to my wardrobe and I have been showing you all throughout videos pretty much everything that I've bought. I am a UK size 14, sometimes that means I buy a 16, sometimes it means I buy a 12, normally it's a 14. I have quite a big waist, I'm an apple shape and I have rather large boobs. So I buy things that I think will work for my body shape and one of the reasons that I really enjoy doing these videos is to help other people who are a similar shape find clothes that they feel good in. Because let's face it, when the model is a straight up, straight down size 8 or 10 and they're really tall, I have no idea what that's going to look like on me. So a lot of it is trial and error and I love following Instagram accounts of people with similar body shapes to me. So if you're watching this and my body shape is ringing bells and sounds familiar to yours, then hopefully you will find this video helpful. This top that I've got on and this skirt are both from New Look. I absolutely love this top. I love everything about it. I love the colour, the shape. I think it's really flattering on me and it's quite a loose fit so it's really comfy to wear and it hides all the lumps and bumps. The skirt is just a plain denim button up skirt that I think will just go with anything. This next item that I'm wearing now also from New Look is a denim smock dress. Now normally I would steer right clear of smock dresses as they often hang quite shapeless which isn't good for my body shape but this one is nipped in at the waist so I had a feeling it might work well and I also like the wide sleeves, I think that helps balance out my body. The thing I love about this dress is you can wear it with bare legs in spring and summer and you can also team it with some tights and some boots in winter. Next up is this cream cold shoulder dress from New Look. This is my first foray into cold shoulder dresses and tops and I'm not quite sold yet but I do like the relaxed vibe of this dress. If you're not too keen on the cream, this also came in a few other colours. I can't remember, but you can have a look on the New Look website. This dress is my last item from New Look. I bought it as a contender to wear to a wedding. I really like the shade of pink. I really like the design, but I'm not quite convinced about the top half on me. And I also don't think I could get away with wearing a bra with this one. And wearing a bra is a pretty important factor for me. This lace dress is from H&M, it also comes in a red and a light blue if you prefer those colours. This was another dress that I bought as a potential dress to wear for a wedding. I really like this fit, I love the flare of the skirt, I think it's really flattering on my shape. Another good thing about this dress is that the shoulder straps are adjustable, so for people like me with short torsos and shoulders, you can shorten up the straps so it will still fit you well. I'm obviously just wearing my standard bra that I've got on today, which I wouldn't wear with this. I'd have to try and think of a different type of solution because obviously it's a teeny tiny spaghetti strap, so I might need to go for a see-through bra strap or something a little more invisible than this. This is another H&M dress. It is a wrap style dress. It's got a little sort of frilly slit up the side of one leg. So those are the three dresses that I've bought as potential wedding guest dresses. I'm not going to keep all of these. You might have noticed some of these still have the tags in. This is very much a buy, try them on, and then decide which ones I like the best. So if you could please help me out with that. I'd love to hear from you in the comments. Please let me know which of the dresses you think suits me best, which ones you think I should keep, or if there's any that I should definitely take back because they don't suit me. This is another dress from River Island. It's a white embroidered number. We are going to Italy in a couple of weeks and I thought this would be really perfect lightweight dress for hot weather. It's also quite beachy, quite relaxed in its vibe. And I love the length of the skirt. I love that it's not too long. I think a shorter skirt actually suits me better. The next few items I'm gonna show you are from Sainsbury's. You can actually buy their clothing range online too. Just search for two. TU and you'll find at the online store. I bought a couple of jumpsuits. The first one I can't actually do a try on because it's in the wash. It got covered in Otto snot. So it's not very nice to look at at the moment. So I'm going to insert a photo or two of it now. 
I actually didn't think much of this jumpsuit in the flesh but when I tried it on I actually thought it was a lot more flattering than it was going to be and it's so comfy and just super easy to wear. It's got a zip down the front so it's perfect if you're still breastfeeding. It actually comes up a little bit large so although I'm normally a 14 I bought this in a 12. And then I got another jumpsuit from Sainsbury's. It is this one that I'm wearing now and it's just a sort of black and white palm leaf print jumpsuit. There's nothing special but it's just easy to put on if you're going on holiday or it's a hot day and you're doing the school run it's just so easy to wear. I knew I wanted this dress as soon as I saw it. It's just such a fun print and even though it is a supermarket dress I do think you could definitely get away with wearing this to a summer wedding. I bought this dress online so I don't know whether it's available in the Sainsbury's store. Sometimes they do items that are only available online and this might be one of those because I didn't see it in store but you can buy it online. These denim shorts are from Sainsbury's as well. I love that they have a little bit of extra detail in the fun embroidery. They are quite short which is something I've avoided for years but I do quite like short shorts so I'm embracing them, I'm bringing them back into my wardrobe. I'm wearing them here with a t-shirt from H&M. So that is it, that's all the clothes. I think I'm fully sorted for all my summer clothes this season and definitely sorted for any weddings that I need to attend. I'm really enjoying doing these videos which is weird to say because if you asked me about three years ago, even two years ago, one and a half years ago, I would have said completely the opposite. I was absolutely scared to put myself in front of the camera. I didn't want people to see my body shape, what I looked like. I was so low in confidence. I thought I looked horrendous in everything. Nothing has actually changed since then in my body shape or my weight. The only thing that has changed is my attitude towards it. I started thinking maybe I should look into getting some new clothes. That kind of gave me a confidence boost and I found the process of documenting what I bought and how it looks on my body not only useful for other people with a similar body shape but actually also really useful for my own confidence. So I'm really loving doing these clothing videos let me know if you're enjoying them like this video give it a thumbs up subscribe if you're not subscribed and I'll see you next time bye